Hey guys, myself Rakesh and in this video we are going to learn how do you import a specific function in a module, in a python module. Myself Rakesh and you are into automate with Rakesh channel. Please do subscribe in case you would like to learn everything in python in detail. So in this our objective is pretty simple. I would like to import a specific function in python. Now to understand this I am going to take a blank py file okay i have created a py file and i'm going to write something here now to understand this let's uh, take an example of students okay so i'm going to store few student names let's say student one you can call a function or a call a variable specific portion of that module okay I, i'm going to show you so i have written student one and i'll be using a dictionary so i'll be using curly braces and let's say i want to write name then you have to use a colon and the name is let's say John okay comma and then let's say age age again colon and then the age is let's say 12 um, let's store something called grade again with single quote or double quote grade doesn't matter colon uh, the grade is let's say he's in fifth standard let's say you know I'm just taking some example random examples so here I'm going to copy this and I'm going to paste it let's say a couple of times and I'm going to simply change the student one to let's say student two and student uh, three simple and let's say the names we will change to Sam uh, the student third is let's say Harry okay and the age let's say changes to 15 let it change to 14 something like that okay and then let's say he is into seventh standard let's say he is into ninth standard something like that i'm just entering some random data so here what is happening in this py file or in this module i have got multiple different data and i would like to only import a specific data from it or a specific function or a variable whatever you wanted to import so how that can be written we need to learn okay it's very simple initially how you used to do you used to simply write import and the function name you used to write right the module name you used to write but in this case because i have to uh, import a specific thing from the uh, module for that i will be using a keyword called from okay from and then i'll have to write the name of the uh, module which is automate with rakesh okay and then and i can say import what you would like to import i would like to import let's say student 2 again these are all case sensitive student 2 right so i have imported only student 2 now let's say i would like to see the value of uh, let's say i want to assign the name of the student 2 into the variable called x so what i will do i'll use the student 2 that specific variable because i have already imported i can take the name without using the module name i'm simply taking the variable name now or the function name whatever you are trying to call student 2 and then um, I would like to see let's say the name so I will simply say name okay hit on enter and let me try to see the value so you can play around with this but again this is the simple way to get it and you can see the value Sam has been printed because student 2 name was Sam so likewise you can fetch any value of that specific function or a variable you can call it and import so here what is the learning point the learning point is just to remember the syntax anytime i have to import a specific function in python uh, from the module in that case all i have to write is from and the module name import and the what exactly i would like let the function name you have to provide or the variable name and then you can pass it like this or there are multiple different ways through which I can get the specific values because they are stored in a dictionary. So how do you access a dictionary? All that would apply here and you can get the values as you require. So thank you guys for watching. This is a sim simple video just to let you know the syntax and how you can use it. So please do subscribe to my channel and we are going to meet once again in our next content. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.